Beijing's urban transport system is getting a shiny new upgrade. By the end of the year, maglev trains will start running on a brand new train line. On the surface, everything looked the same. Underneath, it's a different story. Taking the place of wheels found on typical subway carriages are powerful magnets that, as the name suggests, allow the trains to levitate above the tracks. What we are seeing now is the core part of the train. Once turned on, it will lift the train up, and the gap between the train and the rail is maintained at eight millimeters. China holds the intellectual property rights for this technology. Unlike the systems used for high-speed maglev lines, the new technology is optimized for urban transport. The new Beijing line will have a top speed of 100 kilometers per hour. Using maglev trains addresses many of the challenges faced by normal subway systems. Compared to wheel-to-rail technology, the maglev train requires a smaller turning radius of less than 100 meters. And has good performance in climbing as well as noise control. Its electromagnetic radiation is far below the level of current wheel-to-rail lines, and is in accordance with international standards. The S1 line will run through populated urban areas. It will have eight stops and connect with Line One, which is the busiest in Beijing. S1 is very similar to current subway lines in Beijing. We set stops based on simulations of passenger density. There are two transfer stops, and all are allocated with stations for buses, taxis, and other means of public transport. This new technology aims to pave the way for a more ubiquitous use of maglev technology in commuter lines in the years to come. This cutting-edge magnetic levitation technology will soon start ferrying passengers across Beijing. If this trial proves successful, it seems set to usher in a shining new era for city transport in the future. Ning Hong, CGTN, Beijing.